Hey guys, and welcome back to another one of Sharky's Adventures. Today is a little bit different. Um, last night I received a knock on the door and there was a note left there. Now the note was left from Patrick and Spongebob and they said that Scuba Steve and Donut last week... Oh, there's a cow. Don't move. Nobody move. Oh, he's okay, he's okay. So, last week the guys said that Donut and Scuba Steve, they had loads of fun becoming policemen and I missed out and it looked so much fun. So today I'm going to come down to the job center behind me and see if I can get myself a job. And I hope it's going to be as fun and as cool as being a policeman. And I think Patrick and Spongebob are going to meet me inside. So come on inside guys and let's go in. Okay guys, so let's head on inside. Whoa, look at the size of this place. It is so big. They must give out so many jobs. Oh, there's the guys. Hey, Patrick. Hey, SpongeBob. Guys, do you know that I have a letterbox that you could leave these things in? And did you know that there's sociable hours to knock at people's houses? You were knocking at my door at 1 o'clock in the morning last night. If Scuba Steve had awoken up, he would have been super angry at you guys. But anyway, let's have some fun. What do you think the job is going to be? I'm super excited. Donut and Scuba Steve last week got to be policemen. And it looked like so much fun. So, oh, I think we get to do something cool today. Oh, but here. um, I think this is the guidance counselor guy. Or he is the recruiter. Either way, he is going to hook us up with a pretty sweet job. So, um, uh, hello, sir. Uh, Sharky, Patrick, and Spongebob reporting for a duty. What do you have for us today? Oh, well, hey guys. Uh, welcome to the job center. I understand you're looking for a bit of excitement. Well, I hope your new job will be just that. Today, guys, you're gonna be firemen. Head down to the local fire station and ask for the chief. And hey guys, good luck. <gasps> no, wait. Oh my god, did you guys hear that? We are becoming firemen. Ooh, ooh, I've always wanted to be a fireman ever since I lived under the water all my life. Yes. I know that sounds silly, but it's true. I've always wanted to go out and live in the in the big city springs and put out fires from all over the ocean. Okay, so I never wanted to be a fireman. Fire scares me, but still, today is going to be so much fun. So, guys, I say um, thank you very much, sir, uh, and we head down there now. Come on, guys, follow me. Guys, look at this place. Oh, it's so big. Oh, look at the big helicopter. Oh, that is so cool. Oh, there's a fire down there. Oh, they must be practicing. Look at the fire trucks and all the firemen running around the place. This place is awesome. Are you guys as excited as I am? I hope so because I am super excited. Um, hello, Mr. Mr. Fireman. Um, we are here to, to report for duty. Uh, you must be the new guys from for the day. Go and meet the chief inside. Okay, so here that guys, we have to go meet the chief inside. I don't think it's a chief like the Indians. Like, how? No, I think he's gonna show us how to be fireman. Uh, <laughs> let's get what I did. Oh, okay, no, maybe not. Okay, tough crowd. Um, uh, excuse me, sir. He said we have to go meet the chief inside. Any other words of advice? Head inside and grab your gear. Then meet us back out here to start your training. Oh, that sounds so cool. Okay, guys, so I think we should just go ahead and side and have a look for the fire chief. Ooh, what's going on down here, though? I wonder if... Ooh, it's very warm down here. Hello, sir. Be sure to keep a safe distance from the fire. Oh, that's good thinking. That is definitely good thinking because I probably would have just jumped straight in. It looks nice and toasty. Okay, let's go inside and see if we can find the chief. Um... Hello, Chief. Oh, Ch Chief? No, okay, that's not the Chief. And uh, Chief, maybe the Chief is upstairs. Whoa, look at this place. This must be where they get all the 911 calls, just in case. Um, I still don't see the Chief around. Maybe he's in the other building. I should go check. Hold on, I go back down. 
And come back around. Maybe he is. Oh, he could be up there. He could be across the way. So, uh, hello, Mr. Fireman. Oh, there's so many firemen around the place. This place is so cool. Oh, there's loads more. Lo oh, look at these guys. Whoa, you be careful. You get down from there. You can break your neck. Oh, these guys are meant to be clever. Um, hello, sir. Um, no, no one in here. Um, through, through here, hello. Oh, no, he's just having his lunch. Okay, let him have his lunch in peace. Um, no, not him either. Uh, you, no, he's not the chief. Where is the chief? We gotta find the chief first, guys. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and try upstairs. Hello, Mr. Fireman. Are you having your lunch? Don't forget to clean up your plate. Safety first with cleaning, of course. Um, okay, what's going on down here? Um, oh, whoa, this must be like the demo room. Okay, well, we might need that later, but we still need to fall. Oh, there's the toilets. I don't want to see it there. Um, oh, there he is. Oh, there's the chief. Um, hello, chief. My name is Sharky. The guy at the recruiting agency in the job center sent me down here. Um, he he told me to ask for you, so I suppose uh, my Sharky, uh, reporting for duty. Hello there, Sharky. I trust you brought your friends with you. Today, you'll find out what it takes to be a fully-fledged fireman. Go down to the locker rooms and get changed. Then report to the front yard for training. Okay, Chief, that sounds amazing. I'm gonna go grab Patrick and SpongeBob and we'll go down and get changed. Okay, oh, sorry, Dart. Okay, okay, okay. So, I better go grab the guys and we'll go down to the locker rooms and get changed. Oh, I'm so looking forward to this. It is going to be so cool. I can't wait to look all dapper and looking like a proper fireman. Okay, so first, I suppose I need. Oh, there they are. I'll go in here. Get changed and we'll go out and meet the guys. Oh god guys, look at us. We look so cool. We definitely look the part. I think if all else fails, we could definitely win best dress fireman in here. We look awesome. Okay, well, I suppose less talking about ourselves and more worrying about what we need to learn. So I know that we have to keep a safe distance from the fire. That's one, two, three, four blocks. Okay, that's good to know guys. Keep four blocks away. Wait, what was that? Is that that's some sort of alarm? Oh no! Oh, I better I better ask I better ask this guy. He looks nice, but he's not what he's doing, sir. Well, what does that alarm mean? Well, sir, that means there's a good old fire to burn him. So why don't you grab the guys, jump in the chapter, and let's find out where this fire is. Apparently, it's local in a car park. Maybe some kids or something. But we still have to go and find it and put it out. Oh, does this mean, oh, did you hear that guys? We get to be real firemen. There is a fire local in a car park down the road. They think it may be some teenagers. Maybe set a car on fire, set some bins on fire. But we have to get up into that helicopter and make our way down there. So come on guys, join me, let's go. Okay guys, so we're here and as you can see this fire is huge behind us. It is like they set something on fire right in the middle of the car park or maybe trash or I don't know what it is, but it seems to be getting... Wait, wait, why did you guys take... <gasps> you guys took off your fireman suit. Nothing is on you. Did you both get scared? Is that what happened? Oh guys, so this is all up to me now. Okay, okay, I better go. I better go speak to the commander. Um... I guess you guys will have to train some other time. This is the real deal. Take the buckets of water from the chest and start putting out the fire from the bottom up. Okay, well, um, I think it's a bad time to tell you, but they don't want to be firemen anymore, so I guess it's up to me. Oh, this fire is pretty big. All the guys running around. Okay, so, oh, okay, there's a few buckets of water here. Okay, so start from the bottom and work my way up. So I'm going to throw a bucket here. How's that going? Oh! Oh, that did an awesome job. Okay, okay, next one I'm gonna throw from here. Is that gonna do? Is that is that okay? Oh, this is too well. Okay, okay, perfect. Okay, so we're doing we're doing good so far, guys. I'm out up here, up here, up there. Come on, guys, spread it out. Okay, okay, a few more buckets left. Okay, okay, okay. I wanna get this guy. Whoa, no! There's so much water around. Okay, we can nearly we can do this. 
One last bucket. Come on, we can do it. Yeah, we did it. Woohoo! Look, I see. That wasn't so tough. I am an honorary fireman. Look, I put out that fire good and proper. Oh, I am so proud of that. Oh, hey guys, what do you think? Do you think I did a good job? Oh, turn your back, people. That, that's kind of rude. I think I done a good job. Anyway, guys, do you think I did a good job? Oh, I am so happy with that. What do you think, sir? I think you are welcome back to be a fireman on my watch any day. Good job. Head back to the HQ for some lunch. You deserve it. Oh, that is just what I wanted to hear. <gasps> Maybe they have some Krabby Patties, Patrick, just for you. Okay, guys, so I suppose we better head back to the HQ. Get some lunch like this man said because I, well, I only assume there's going to be more adventure after lunch. Come on, guys, let's go. Okay, guys, that is the end of us being fireman. I had so much fun today. Thank you for Patrick and SpongeBob for coming with me. I can't wait to tell Scuba Steve and Donald the next time I see him just how well we done today becoming honorary firefighters Woohoo! guys don't forget if you liked the episode leave a like and maybe even a comment saying what other jobs you would like me and scuba steve and maybe some of the other guys to do together in the next few days so make sure to leave a like and a comment and don't forget to check us out on our twitter and our instagram all the links are in the descriptions below until next time guys bye <laughs>